Hey, what's up everybody? It's Mr. Ninja GFX here bringing to you another speed art video. Uh, this video is actually for FaZe Banks. Uh, personal shout outs over to FaZe Banks for everything he ends up doing for the esports community as well as another personal shout out that I hope you end up getting feeling better, bud. Um, if you do happen to watch this video, I completely will nerdgasm um, and I uh, hope you end up seeing about how much I actually enjoyed doing this painting for you and at some point in time whenever the other guys over at the FaZe House actually answers me back about what the P.O. Box number is for over at the FaZe House, you can en enjoy the painting in person as much as I enjoyed doing it for you. So, besides that, anybody that has not actually watched any of my speed art videos in the past and don't know exactly how this works, I will do a commentary for the beginning portion, anyway, of the painting itself, and then I will let the rest of it play out so you can enjoy the music. Um, and if for anybody that has not watched any of my uh, previous speed art videos, there will be annotations throughout the entire uh, video that you can actually click on that will bring you to any of my past up. Uh, speed arts that I ended up doing as well as the information will be in the uh, description down below. Now besides that, uh, kind of getting into the painting itself, uh, so I start off with a blank canvas and then I actually start off using watercolors. The uh, watercolors that I end up using is red, then red orange, and then a like a lighter red. Um, and then I end up just kind of doing a, a design, a kind of like a donut uh, circle design that starts in the middle and then works its way out, like kind of like a ripple. Um, after I end up doing that, I want to go back in with a sponge, different types of sponges, uh, wet and dry, and actually help kind of uh, blend it a little bit better to make it overall just look a lot more presentable and uh, the colors not look so uh, rigid. They blend a lot better and are a lot more flowing, uh, easier flowing. And uh, then I ended up going back in with some wet and dry sponges after that as well to add in additional textures. After I'm done with that, I end up uh, going back in with acrylic paint, red paint, uh, to actually do the Banks logo that I ended up briefly, very quickly creating on my PC. After I get done with the red outline, I actually end up going back in with a white to help it be a little bit more prominent and actually stick out a little bit more. After I get done with doing the white, I don't like on how plain it looks, so I actually end up getting a silver, uh, it looks gray, but it's actually a silver flaked paint that I actually go back over top of and then do a, a rough outline of the actual painting itself, uh, well the Banks logo itself. After I end up getting done with that, I end up uh, not necessarily liking about how the uh, Banks uh, logo or logo in the middle ends up blending with the outside of the actual photo so I end up getting my wet sponge again and end up doing like a texture design uh, kind of like a burn effect around the actual Banks logo itself. After that I uh, realized that I kind of like on how the actual painting is turning out that way so I end up deciding to use the wet sponge again and use multiple different shades and variations of red to go back over the uh, worked area that I ended up doing around the border and make it look more of a kind of a decayed, burning uh, flesh tone. After I end up getting done with that, I end up going back over the entire middle Banks logo with a darker red and ended up helping it become a little bit more prominent and stick out a little bit more. After I get done with that, I uh, end up thinking that it's about done, but then I end up going back over with another darker red around that side that outline of the Banks logo and help it bring it out a little bit more so it sticks out. Overall the painting I think turned out pretty good. Um, as I said before, at the very end of the video I will be putting annotations to where you can look at some of my other uh, speed art videos. Mind you they are a lot longer, this is relatively short. Uh, speed art, but I do hope that everybody ends up enjoying it, and if you did happen to enjoy it, or you want to see some more that I end up uh, posting up, make sure you hit that subscribe button, as well as like it and comment if you end up uh, wanting to. I do read the comments all the time, um, and I will end up replying back to you if you end up putting anything in there, as well as any future su suggestions, comments, or anything, uh, feel free to add them in there, and I will end up reviewing them. Again, guys, a big shout out over to Banks, as well as FaZe, uh, G Fuel, as well as uh, Audio Technica, uh, Astro, and uh, Jerky XP for kind of fueling me along the entire journey of the uh, painting itself. 
again, guys. Thanks again for stopping by, and have a great night, everybody.